I hit a majority of wedges in the last range talk, so starting off with eight iron here. And we'll actually get to driver this time because I know a few of you guys probably wanted to see me hit driver, uh, but the lights shut off on me last time. So we'll get to driver, um, but yeah, I'm just out here at North Shore Golf Course after my shift. This is where I work, um, working on being the assistant pro here. So out here hitting some balls in the evening it's about 6.15. Really kind of just working on the same things as last video. Those are the swing thoughts that are working for me right now. So I'm just riding the wave. Actually, wasn't terrible. It just leaked right on me when I'm trying to hit a draw. So, club face is just open. And I apologize now for the geese. I'm really used to it. But if I'm watching this video and it gets too bad, I might just cut this video completely. I don't know. If you guys are seeing this, that means it's tolerable. So. Or they're just laughing at my shot. That was better. Kind of just pulled that one a little bit, but the shot shape I wanted was there. So my, uh, my car had a bunch of problems with it this week. So, spent like seven hours in a auto shop and $850 later. That was, a, that was a cool hit to the bank account. And I just bought the car off Facebook Marketplace for $3,200. It's an Acura, 2003 Acura. I'm already putting money into it, which is great. Gotta love, gotta love that. I'm slightly pulling everything. It's probably a closed club face. Gotta square that up. That was pure. That was, that was the best one right there. I think I'm gonna title this video something about life having its ups and downs because right now this week, like the, the last eight days, I've been in a real <laughs> downtrend. I mean, I got a lot of stuff going on. At my same time my car had all the lights pop up on the dash my debit card information got stolen. So that was great. Are you coming to get these uh, baskets? I'm just gonna, I was gonna watch your swing. Oh, okay. Cause don't worry about these baskets, I'll take care of them. Okay, I left the one side of the door open. I'll lock it. Okay, great, thanks. Yeah. Thank you. Putting the pressure on me. Good. 
But see how good you are like that. Where does it go left or right? Used to be left because I used to play a fade every like I used to love playing fades, but now I just switched to a draw, so uh -huh. my miss is a block. It's hard to get away from the fade. Yeah. I know, I played it all my life, and my son said, you need to learn how to hit a drop. And I went from one handicap to five. Yeah. And it just, it took me like two and a half years to get back. Yeah. So, it's, I love a thing. I just switched to a draw like two months ago. Yeah. But I've been... Golf, most golf courses, they're designed for faders. Yeah, I didn't land softer and... Yeah. Yeah. conversation basically I was elaborating that I switched to a draw about two two months ago and I normally I've been playing a fade for like the last four years but I naturally draw the ball so I was fighting my natural swing for a long time I'm just starting to just trust the draw and I like it but that was what that conversation was right there Anyways, what I was getting to is, yeah, the same time my car had to get work done on it, my debit card information got stolen, so I had to freeze my card and call them and talk about fraud claims and, you know, all the good stuff like that. It's bad timing because they sent themselves $300 on PayPal. I have a PayPal account, but I never use it, so it obviously wasn't me, and I'd already spent you know, money on repairs for my car and the initial, you know, three, three grand. So, holy crap, that wind is strong. Damn. Are we still going? The geese might not even matter if I can't even freaking, you can't even hear me from the wind. Two iron. Moving to two iron. Today, I was babysitting my little sister and I parked in a spot where I parked the last year and a half. And I had a parking ticket on my windshield, so that was awesome. You know, everything is all about gratitude. So, I'm complaining. I'm sitting here complaining, you know. Uh, but at least I have a car to complain about. You know, I could be riding the bus. But I, you know, have a car that <laughs> can break down. People don't have a car. They, they don't have a car that can break down in the first place. So, I'm just lucky that I have a car that I had you know, money to buy a car, money to do the repairs, and a car that can get a parking violation because people, you know, there's a lot of people that don't have cars and they have to ride the bus everywhere. And, you know, I'm just, in these downtrends, I try to remind myself to stay grateful because I still do have it good compared to a lot of people in this world. But, it's still really hard to do that because it's really easy to just get sucked into the negative stuff. 
My uh, my dog ate my AirPods today too, which was great. My sister sent me a picture uh, while I was at work, like two hours ago. So I use those things every day. I forgot them today, and yeah, the dog ate them, chewed them up. But hey, at least I have Air I had AirPods. You know, I was in a position where I owned AirPods. A lot of people don't have AirPods, and you know, I'm just still trying to practice gratitude because. It's honestly how you keep yourself grounded, and it's a good—it's a good thing to practice. So I—I I, I wanted to come up here and uh, do this series because I want to help people. You know, I don't—I I, want to grow the game of golf, but I also want to help a lot of people in this generation, and and even if you're older than me, you know, just pick my brain and get my insights on how life uh, is lived and kind of get a get a peek at my personality and who I am as a person because in my high highly edited videos like the wolf video and the scramble video like it's go 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 I'm trying to make it as engaging as possible and there's not really a whole lot of opportunity to mix my personality in there completely um, so I like this series because I'm able to do that That was pure. All right, we're gonna hit a low draw. Low, low hook, like out of the trees or something. An escape shot. That would work, like tree line for like 40 yards, hooking it back into like on a dog leg left or something. That'd be cool. I got a lot of support on this series so far. The first one is uh, almost 2,000 views, which is just phenomenal. Like that's a, that's so good. That was pure. That was that was probably the best three wood I've hit in about three weeks. That was that was really good. I'm gonna end on that one. Ran out of teas in my bag, so I'm glad there's some right here. It's kind of broken, but it'll work for a swing or two. Maybe we'll see. Well, I hit like three balls. And I went to check to see if I was in frame. I'm glad I did because I ran out of storage on my phone. So I just got done clearing a bunch of stuff. And now, so I don't even know how much of that you guys watched, but. I feel like I'm always ending these videos like this at my car, put my clubs away, but. My iPhone storage is just bugging. I thought I cleared enough and then it kept stopping again. So hopefully you got a little bit of driver there. I know I promised that we were gonna get to driver, but I need to get a camera. I need to get a camera and a wireless mic. And uh, I feel like that would solve a lot of issues. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this range talk number two. And there was some valuable stuff in there. I'm gonna continue to do this internet golf stuff and uh, this is just the beginning.